Hello everyone, how you doing? Welcome to a cheeky little Friday afternoon extra bonus stream. Um, got this game, it came out yesterday, uh, the developer kindly sent it to me, so thank you very much. Um, it's out on PC, early access, um, sorry not early access, it's out on PC, um, it's 8 99 it's also on the Switch as well. And what it is, it's, um, I'm using the controller, it's a rhythm based, um, it's a rhythm based game with influences and parodies of old 8-bit 8, 8 and 16-bit games. Um, I've done some of it and I absolutely loved it. I was just sitting here for an hour last night playing it, absolutely loving it. It's a bit weird, it's a bit crazy. I think you're going to like it, that's why I wanted to do it in a stream. Um, you can help me spot some of the, the parodies in it, because apparently it's full of parodies of old school. Some of them are over my head, some of them I've got it. Um, I think you're going to really, really like it. Um, I'm going to start with a story. Now I've already unlocked all of this last night, this is how good it was, I was playing it last night, but I'm going to start at the tutorial at the start, just so you get a feel for what the game is. Um, help me out with this first one, I think it's Harvest Moon, I think it's called Harvest Moon. Uh, I'm just going to do normal, um, and you'll get an idea, it's a funny story, whoever developed it has got a wicked sense of humour. Um, so far I've seen Metal Gear, um, Outrun, is this Harvest Moon? My brother and I grew up together with our mother. We thought their world around us was infinite. This is really cool, honestly. I'm quite excited about showing you this. The vast expanse of grass beyond the garden. Is this Harvest Moon? The warm sand withstanding the sea breeze. Obviously they're parodies, not direct copies, yeah. Um, our small desert island seemed limitless. I love the music as well. The music is just everything in this. The small island which we've roamed thousands of times. Every day, Mother trained us. <laughs> Look at Mother. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. She would tell us over and over again that we would become heroes. Heroes of the legend destined to save the universe. You'll love it, Robbo. Just just wait, you'll like it. Mother was hard on us, uh, but that was all we knew. And you'll love it. Sometime at night, Rob and I would go out. Look at the sprites, look. This is so retro goodness, isn't it? When the only sound to be heard was the wind rustling through the grass. Underneath these billions of stars, we made a promise to each other. Harvest Moon Battle Royale. Of course. Edgy clickbait. That we'd run away as far as possible from there, together. This small island was our whole world. You wait till it, uh, you get the games. Really good, I'm very excited about this. But we're already dreaming of being elsewhere. It's parodies of lots of retro uh, games, so stick with it, because it's not just this, there's loads of stuff. Hey Rob, what are you doing? Colouring? <laughs> Can I do voices and stuff? I love doing voices. Mm, let me see. Oh fucking hell. It's Mother. Mother? <laughs> you forgot to draw thorns on her whip, but still it's rather realistic. For a three-year-old, you've got some talent. <laughs> talent. <laughs> However, you're still a bit stupid. This is awesome. I love retro stuff. You're still young, and the training is difficult. But we'll get used to it. You're much better at it than what than I was when I was your age. Come up as completed, yeah. Three years old, and you're already three times my height. I don't understand what's wrong with me. <laughs> Cake bid it. <laughs> then again, I was three times more intelligent when I was your age. Okay, you're going to get the idea of the game in a minute. It's a rhythm-based game. Uh, Drat, she's coming. Ho, 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 children! It's Santa Claus! Look at Mother, look. Mother, you can't open the door with a handle, you know. What tip? You didn't enjoy my grand entrances. It's the eighth time you've broken the door this week. Ho, ho, ho. Your younger brother's got the right idea. It makes him laugh. I'm ten years old, Mother. That doesn't make me laugh anymore. And he's not the one who's going to have to fix this door. Got to come in, come on. Instead of complaining, come to the dojo with Rob. It's time for your training. No, no washing feet in cake. <laughs> this brat is really dumb. 
<laughs> it is crazy, Andy. Honestly, just stick with it for a few, for a few minutes. See if you like it. Right, so this is tutorial level. I wanted to do this just to show it to you, so you get an idea of what it is. It's not too loud, is it? Right, it's my turn now. Here we go. But it does get really hard, trust me. It gets really hard. Stick with it. Don't go anywhere. Or don't go anywhere. You'll like it, alright? You're less inept than usual, children. It was about time. We'll increase the difficulty. How about a second button? It was out yesterday. It's on PC and uh, Switch as well. Let's get serious. Trigger buttons and shoulder buttons. Behold my skill. So they're just setting this up now. It's a Witcher bonus level. They're just setting it up now so we'll be able to enjoy it together. <laughs> Everyone's coming in. What the fuck? This is why I love indie titles. I love indie titles purely for that reaction. You just don't get that, do you? You know? Not bad, children. One last warm up for the road. Here we go. No. No. <laughs> You've only pressed me for a score like that. Never forget, children, if you're too weak, you can pause and change the difficulty. Awesome. We can start training. Join me in the garden. Right, so it's not all about this um, this Harvest Moon type thing. There's loads of other parodies coming. Bear with it. All right. <clears throat> you missed all of them. I did. Yeah, I think you was meant to miss them. Well, children, it's time to duel. <laughs> what are we going to do today? I don't know yet, but you should try to escape fast. Okay. <laughs> what a noob. Just stick with it. Don't go anywhere, alright? Don't go anywhere. It's for the music, right? And I love all the way that the... It's all going on in the background. I love it. And obviously the better you do, the more impact you have on the scenario in the background. But for me, it's the music. I fucking love this music. Look at Mother, look. Rob, get ready. Here we go. This is me playing, honestly, alright? Yeah, I know you would, Codus. <laughs> Fucking hell. This is straight in as well. <laughs> Scarabs, oh my god. Stick with it, it's fun, honestly. It made me laugh a lot. So the background's on static, stuff is going on whilst you're whilst you're doing it. <laughs> what are you doing? Indie baby. What are you doing? I'm getting at what you're doing. That's fine, they'll miss out. They'll miss out, Robo. Stop you brats! <laughs> it's fine. Just stick with it, alright? It's fun. And the music gets better as well. This is this is more fun. There's some serious old school game music coming. So you can see I'm hitting all the buttons on the Xbox controller. Look at Imperfect's coming up though, look. You can play on the keyboard as well. It is out on the Switch. It would suit the Switch, wouldn't it?
<laughs> I'm never drinking again. I don't believe you, Grant. So it's about parodies of games. Is this Harvest Moon? Can we have a confirmation on that? <laughs> Why a fat kid, Phoenix? Why not just any kid? Okay, so let's carry on. And then after this, I'll take you to the Metal Gear Sol Solid parody and um, Outrun as well, which is quite good. Don't forget it's Harvest Moon. Oh, okay. What is it then? That looks like this. Uh, she's throwing this out. What do you want to do? Just get ready for this bit because I fucking laughed out loud. I won't now because I've already seen it. I laughed out so loud so much at this bit. So I'm going to choose a dodge. Look at this. Look what she's doing. <laughs> Big Mama looks for attack in her secret pocket. <laughs> oh my god, in her secret pocket. It's a grenade, of course it is. It's super effective, she's starting out strong. Is it Pokemon then? Is it really? Oh, okay. I never play Pokemon. You perfectly avoided the attack. Big Mama is getting angry. She's preparing for a new attack. Let's uh, barrel roll. <laughs> Big Mama looks for attack in her secret pocket. Oh, it's Pokemon. And she it's a washing machine. One wonders where she hides all of this. I love the, the comedy. What an acrobatic dodge. Uh, Big Mama thought that the washing machine attack would work. Watch out, she's about to attack. Let's do a dance. You start to dance wildly. <laughs> she's back in her secret pocket. <laughs> Not could be, but is. Oh, Robbo's getting straight in there. It's disgusting. Seriously, what is that thing? The power of dance makes you invincible, which it will do at EGX, won't it? Big Mama seems tired. She decided that's enough for today. Fucking hell, when I saw her get in her, in her secret pocket. Oh, my God. I thought it was Harvest Moon. It might be, it might be Pokemon, apparently, someone said. So, Rob, what's it, what's it like to be 16? It's just another year stuck with you on this desert island. <laughs> Good one. Did you ask Mother for something for your birthday? Yes, an entire day with no training. And what does she say? She maybe do 300 push-ups. Wretched Mother. So, Big Brother, do you think that we'll manage to escape this island one day? Difficult to say. Difficult to say. It's been so long now. But I haven't forgotten our promise, and we'll keep looking for a way to get there. Oh, something's happening. Did you see that too, Rob? Oh, yes. This doesn't seem to be getting any better. Hello, bod. Yeah, I know, the graphics are still the same, yeah. We should go ask Mother for help, and fast. I like this game, it's fun. I'm gonna... <laughs> yeah, look for that secret pocket. Mother! Looks like she is in here. There's something on the table. Don't forget to leave it this like No, just leave it, alright? I love retro games. The, I thought of you lot, alright? We love old games. We love old gaming music. Just wait. Just stop it, alright? <laughs> it's a letter from Mother. Children, the world is glitching. You must escape. Take this letter and the controller and meet me at the communication tower. P.S. Rob, do 300 push-ups for me. I like the, I like the, uh, the comedy in it. I love the graphics. I love the music, alright? The communication tower, what's that? <laughs> no idea, but I've never seen anything like it on our own. Everything's glitching out. They're in our house. We have to get out of it. Don't forget to leave a dislike. Cheeky git. So the house is glitching out as well. And it shouldn't be on the beach. It's moved. We need to find mother. Come on, Rob. Here we go. <laughs> Consider unsubbing. Oh, come on, listen to that gaming music. Come on. Doesn't that bring back memories? It does for me. Maybe you're not real. Oh, maybe you're not real gamers. Oh, okay. Hello Natty, how you doing? Mm. 
love this music, seriously, love it. Wow. And funnily enough, this is the sort of music, um, sorry, I've got such an itchy nose. This is, um, when we go to EGX, the nightclub, this is the sort of music they remix and they do it awesomely. Obviously I'm doing the uh, shoulder buttons there. Come on, that music is awesome, isn't it? It's cool and good. Yeah, it is, yeah. You know with my channel, I take you everywhere, right? It ain't just the latest, the greatest. Forget that. We're gamers. I think this is cool, actually. For an indie game, um, just for a bit of originality, I think it's done pretty well. And you'll see some more parodies in a minute. I'll take you to a few other levels. I like the way shit's going on in the background, I love that. Now obviously they're working out why this uh, glitch is happening to their to their world. Come on, we're getting a few perfects as well. <laughs> this is for bus stops. <laughs> Don't worry Tib, we'll get it. On guard you big pile of glitches. So it's brand new out yesterday on Steam and on Switch as well. Which it'd be perfect for the Switch, wouldn't it? Links in the description if you want to check it out on stream. That's uh, game. Steam. Eight ninety nine. There's twenty different um, parody levels though. It, it gets quite in depth. Eight ninety nine. Yeah. So we'll finish this one. I'll take you to Metal Gear Solid, which is pretty cool, and Outrun as well. I think there's a Mega Man. There's a Mega Man one as well. The music is fucking awesome. I love the music. I was in here. I was in here for just over an hour last night playing this, and uh, just purely for the music. What do you mean, wow? Uh, oh, so we can squat? You do squats, nothing to do with the current situation. The glitch is ready. Uh, <laughs> what's the pill for, Arsenal? Wow, I thought you were gamers. Uh, let's do controller. Rob takes mother's controllers from his pocket. He presses all of the buttons. I am running in 4K, actually, Mark. Yeah, I am. A strange orbs. Uh, someone time me out. <laughs> Get back to work, Scarab. A strange orb appears. Okay, I think that's the level over. Oh no, 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 we've got to fight that, that's fine. What is that? It started when I pressed the controller. It's like there's something inside the orb. You think that we can go through it? We don't really have much of a choice, the glitches are everywhere. It's time to jump in. Someone time me <laughs> Right, so that's, that's one level. So we can carry on. Uh, wow, I don't know where we are, but it's different. Uh, no glitches to be seen, I think we've managed to escape them. It's a bit like Final Fantasy, that bit, isn't it? Space. So we're in some sort of space station. Hmm, first the orb, but now an unknown space station. We should look around a bit to see what we can find. So you do get to control him a little bit. And these are the, these are the two levels we've just done. Um, and that one does... That's Mega Man. Uh, I'm not sure... Uh, I think this one... That's Mega Man, so let's go to this one, which I think is Metal Gear Solid, I think. And there's 20 different uh, parodies, apparently. I'm sure this is Metal Gear. Yeah, another new world. And they're all done really well. All the worlds are recreated as they were. Uh, still no sight of mother or a communication tower um, on the horizon. Yeah, they're different. Each level is a different parody of a game, which attracted me. I really like it. Yeah, it's the first Metal Gear. Are the glitches already here? Um, it seems to have quieted down. It's strange. 
We should look around a bit, maybe find something. What is that? Now, come on, this is Metal Gear, isn't it? This is Metal Gear Solid. Ikea Warriors. <laughs> Look, this is cool. Who's there? Tim and Rob at your service. Uh, oh, just Metal Gear. Oh, I got it. Yeah, yeah, cool. This is Major 9. You're on a top secret military base without authorization. I'm sorry, we're travellers and we're lost. Let's see. In any case, I have more pressing matter to attend. Oh, Ikari Warriors. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Uh, what's the problem? The base's defence system has just activated itself and it's out of control. To be honest, my path is blocked by my own robot soldiers. That's ugly. I wonder if he's got a secret pocket as well. Okay, well, goodbye. Aren't you going to help me? I didn't hear it, please. Is that a joke? I am a no grade 9 major. Respect my authority. Too bad, goodbye. Can you help me, please? There, you just had to ask nicely. Go to the harbour and contact me from there. Okay. No one likes it, Pug. I love it. Oh, listen to that music. I love this music. I love it. It just instantly makes me feel good. Which I thought would be perfect for your Friday. Listen to that, that's really cool, isn't it? And obviously you've got to press the buttons on the Xbox controller to correspond with what's going on here. I love the way, it, it's almost like the game is happening in the background, you know? Could be Commando, yeah, yo, it could be Commando, it's got to be some. The, the reason I thought it was Metal Gear was the, the phone and the image of him, you know? Why do you always want to destroy things? Okay, fine. Hello Stretch, how you doing? Love that little bit of wow, love that. What's up with the camera? Camera's alright, isn't it? Harder than it looks, let me tell you, straight away. We can't go any further, call the Major. It's Metal Gear for the... Oh, okay, so it is Metal Gear. Fine Killer Clown! <laughs> don't, don't. Yeah, about that code, I lost it. <laughs> You'll probably be able to hack into it. Okay, here goes nothing. Bingo, he's a born hacker. That's it, he's done. So it is the very first Metal Gear on the NES, gotcha. It had to be, didn't it, with the way the um, the captain was on his uh, next to his phone. Oh shit, bad. we do Outrun next, alright? Perfect. Ish. 69% Sonny!
I'm here. Are you there yet? Yes, what should we do now? I think our antivirus software is the source of the problem. Its code name is Sabat. It protects the main computer against viruses. For some unknown reason, it's gone crazy. Is this controller here? Yeah, exactly. Snake, yes. Uh, you need to go and reinitialize it. And uh, where is your main computer located? On an offshore platform in the server room. Of course it is. Hello, Charlie boy. How you doing? Take the boat to get there. There's an electromagnet grenade under the seat. That should be enough to put it out of service. There's only one grenade? Budget restrictions. Use it well. I have one last task to ask of you. My men have been taken prisoner by the cards. I'll reward you if you set them free. <laughs> I want the strawberry sandwich. Deal. <laughs> I like the comedy. I like it. So I get the music bit. Why is an 8-bit scene... Well, the music is 8-bit and 16-bit, and they're parodies of, of games. Uh, but I would like to talk about it, because otherwise, where would it fit in, Sam? Uh, armed robots are attacking us. We can be shot anytime. And you're walking around in your underwear. <laughs> I didn't choose the underwear. The underwear chose me. And what's more, I can feel the sea breeze blow along the strings of my underwear. This is getting a little bit weird now. I'm sure your skin doesn't breathe as well as in your armored suit. You won't be able to convince me. I tried. Okay. Give me a bandana, please. I'm cold. Dream on. They're just having a thing. It's fine. So I can feel your. Um... Oh, every time I miss one. The... Oh, every time I miss one, the antivirus is coming up. So that fury um, fills up. I'm not sure if you use that at all. Oh my god, I'm getting every single one. It's out on the switch, Sam. I love the way the scene's going on in the background, but I'm sort of concentrating on that. I can see so much going on, but I'm just concentrating on the middle of the screen. The major answer is the free prisoners. Oh. But it's the music, I love this music. Absolutely adore this kind of music. Gosh. I <laughs> think. <laughs> yeah, but that's a good thing. Oh, fucking hell. Now you're making me miss. Oh, no. That's what I love about indie titles. They can just go completely off. And it's fine because they're indie. I love that, you know. Go find the car, uh, car key quickly. It's like a game's happening um, behind you, but you're concentrating on this bit. It, it's good to play. And that music, though. It's really hard as well. It's not. It's not as easy as it as I'm making it look. In playing with the Hotus, no, no. Oh, the music took me back last night. I literally sat here for just over an hour, and with the music turned right up, just playing it, listening to the music. I love the way music, especially gaming music, can just take you back. This take me back to the, the very roots of my gaming. I love it. Do the outrun one next. Oh. You know I like to take you on a, a different tangent sometimes. It can't all be Call of Duty and Forza, can it? That's what other channels do. I like to take you... I like to take you different places. 
And like, if I take my eyes off for a second, which is really hard, I can see what's going on in the background, you know? I like it. I think it's quite an original, to, you know, joking aside, I think it's quite, it's an original concept to use that old school music in, in its own environment, whilst having it all going on in the background. It's a sort of a new style of gaming, which was the rhythm based. Fire in the hole. We need that bear grenade for the antivirus, Sabat. Wasn't my war. Oh, he's lit it off here. Oh, okay. So he... We should have used that grenade for the antivirus. 59%. A little bit lower on that one. Major, almost at the machine room. Well done. You should see a huge computer in front of you. You need to neutralise it. So about that. <laughs> Rob already used the grenade against the guards. Your brother is a bit stupid, isn't he? You'll have to find another way then. Good luck. Okay. This is quite cool. This is like a top-down version of the robot, which I think is done really, really well. Uh, do you see anything that could stop the computer? Oh, okay. Elite Beats, yeah. Okay. And uses touchscreen brilliantly. Nice one. Um, over there, there's a socket. If we unplug it, I should do the trick. Exactly, Mark. That's what he's meant to do. That's perfect. That's what it's meant to do. Virus detected. I think it's mistaken us for viruses. I think that's done really well. Looks like a little spectrum, doesn't it? Elimination of the imminent threat. Look at the socket. It's going to disconnect itself. Oh. <laughs> that is it. Oh, the glitches are back. Maybe you shouldn't have disconnected it. The glitches are getting worse. We need to go right away, Rob. The Major owes me a strawberry sandwich. We don't have time. Come on. <laughs> yeah, you, you do have 10 seconds to comply. Right, let's go to um, the Outrun one. And then I won't put you through any more. So I'm not sure what that one was. There's loads here. Absolutely loads. That's a new one. And then you've got all these, which are going to be all uh, parodies. I think there's 20 different um, complete parodies, um, which I thought was pretty cool. There's a toilet there. Um, so we'll do Outrun, and then um, we'll end it. This one, which I love a bit of Outrun. You must remember this one, though. Welcome to 137th Beach City Clash competition. People from all over the world have come to throw insults at each other. Ladies and gentlemen, let me remind you of the rules. Competition competitors will face each other and must take turns striking their opponent with a brutal turn of phrase. The first one to shed a tear loses the match. This is like you and Robo coders. And for this first round, I'd like you to welcome our current champion, the one and only Robert Robert Tussison. Yeah, I don't think he's going to do the proper music, because obviously copyright, but yeah, something like it. Your voice is so ugly that my boys are going deaf. Tears are forming in my eyes. The competition off to a very strong start. Against him. So you're being dropped in these uh, parodies, you know? Was you really, Mark? I fancy getting that, yeah. Uh, wow, there are a lot of people out here. Well, that's one spectacular entrance. Your name is Gentleman. Tib and Rob. What is this place? Let the match begin. Hey, Dwarf, you're so short that your head smells like your feet. Oh, fuck it now. Here we go. <laughs> oh, God. I'm not sure. It's an optical illusion. Brilliant. You're so short that even when you're close, it looks like you're far away. <laughs> Hey Redneck, you're so stupid, when you throw a, dodge, a dog a ball, you're the one that goes chasing after it. Oh dear. What are you doing? I don't really know, but it's fun. Okay, you big plant, you're so ugly, I don't know if you're talking to your face or you're behind. Speaking of that, you're so fat that your butt cheeks are in different time zones. Oh, you want to play this game? Your mum is so fat, she looks like the Neon City Tower. What mother is in Neon City? Where is that? A few miles away, thanks for the tip. Let's go. You've 
you can take over another train, Miklos. She can take over. Yes, she can. Yeah, that's exactly what you can do. They dared. Quit the competition in the middle of a match. Dishonouring our tradition. Yeah, don't. Yeah, then you can't get back on it. Oh my god, come on. Look at Outrun in the background, it's amazing, isn't it? It gets hard as well. Aero 404, yeah, you spotted it, Andy. Uh, you're so ugly, when you pee, when you peel an onion, it cries. Oh, God. You've dishonoured us, you must pay. It's getting hard. gone. A very long road in this world. <laughs> he's, he's so right, isn't he? <laughs> hey kiddo, you're so flat. You look like... What, a piece of paper? But well, he does sit in there, but you stole my punchline. You really don't have any respect. I want the soundtrack. <laughs> Still getting perfect. Well, I hope that DJ is at EGX again because that's what the whole the whole set was like. It's fucking awesome. I literally can't take my eyes off it. <laughs> oh, I dropped it. Oh god, it's all going tits up. I got it, I got it back. Awesome. Really enjoyed that. I don't know if there's more of that level. I won't show any more after this, I'll let you make your own mind up. I just wanted to come home and show you. There's a cheeky bonus. I think we managed to lose them for now. Too bad I was having fun with them. You've really impressed me, Rob. What a repartee. When you're the youngest brother, you need to learn how to defend yourself in ways other than just by strength alone. Well said. Oh shit, running that petrol. I love the way it's all done as well. I think, I, honestly, I rate this game. I think it's cool. Uh, for an indie using retro in a modern game, I think it's done really well. <coughs> Station's over there. Stop the car. So, Tib, do you think that mother is really a neon city? Because that's what you're doing, you're trying to find the mother. Uh, I don't know if we can trust uh, Robert Hassan. This is out on PC and Switch. Hard to tell, but it's the only lead we've had so far. Neon City Tower, I wonder if it's still a long way away. Oh, Neon City, you're almost there. Oh my god, there's a geezer with some... What the f... Is he from Street Fighter? What? 
I'm Sid, the manager of this repair shop. I couldn't help but over here. Neon City brings back memories. You're so old that you can probably recall the recreation of this world. Where's he from? I recognise him from somewhere. Is that is that a parody of Street Fighter? I'm sure it is. I understand you're participating in that stupid competition in BC. Every time, oh, well, he's from Final Fantasy. Oh, okay. Every time Robertson's gang passes through here, I get a taste of it. Please forgive my brother. He has trouble controlling his emotions. You know what? I'm a potato. Oh, that's normal. For the gash, you owe me. Hello, doggy. 300 kilos of potatoes. I think the glitches are starting to spread over here. Do you recognise him from somewhere? <laughs> Lots of cheeky streams this week. Not all popular games, right? Some are just indies that you just wouldn't get to see. This is why I like showing them off. gaining on us. They, they've got to be from Bot Road Rash. Yes, you're totally right, yeah. <clears throat> you're so handsome. So handsome that I have tears in my eyes. Can we get a Switch Room in Discord if I buy this? We can have a Switch Room if you want. I think it's needed. I'm going to start doing Switch stuff. In fact, I should have just done this on the Switch. It would look exactly the same, so it doesn't really matter. I think it... Little games like this would super switch a hundred percent. War Thunder's coming to Switch, which is quite interesting. Oh my god. <laughs> You're so strong, I love you. This is getting a bit... It's not getting any better for him. We need to find Mother and fast. The glitch is getting worse by the minute. Giving up is not an option. I know, I want to I beat him. Oh! He almost lost that one. A ball, a ball. <laughs> if anyone's epileptic, please let me know. <laughs> Fucking hell, this is crazy. Oh god, why'd you lose one of them? Oh god, we got shoulder ones coming as well. <laughs> Make contain flashing. Oh god, we've gone down to 20 watching. It's good, I want I want to show you these games. I'll, I'll never stop showing you these games as well. Indie games, I love indie games. I've just had an accident in my pants. 
<laughs> Again, Sam, we told you about that. No, I love showing you these. I think I'm actually tripping. I'm going to cuddle you so hard. This is... He's a lost cause. There's Neon City. See, the way it's all done, I like the presentation of it. I think it's done perfectly. But it doesn't resemble Mother at all. Robertson, you lied to us. I'm sorry, you're both so handsome that you look like... What's this handsome business? Aren't... Isn't this boy 16 and the other one is about three years old? Or am I mis misunderstanding that? Choke me, Daddy! Okay, so you compare everything to the Neon City? There's another wild goose chase. I can't believe it. <laughs> Will this be one of the free ones uh, on the Switch Online? I've no idea, Sam. I doubt it. Um, run away before it's too late. Hello, Christine. How you doing? He's right. Do you want to see another level, or have you had enough? Tell me. Just tell me if you want to see another level. We have got a new one here, which I've obviously haven't pressed. I don't know what it is. Tell me in the chat now if you want another level, or that's it. Tell me now. Tell me now. Tell me now! Do you want to see one more level? Uh, I think my eyes and ears are bleeding. Yes, but with good retro blood. Alright, we'll do, we'll do one more. We'll do one more. I haven't done this one. Obviously, I've done all the rest of them. I like it. I honestly like this game. I think it's cool. I think it's a good... Um, okay. See if we can spot the parody. But the door is closed. What do we do now? I think I can open it, but it might take a while. Yeah, obviously it's not like, you know, 100 people watching. It's fine though, it's fine. I'd like to get these games out there so people can see them, you know. Hold that back until you're done. Especially as it's on the Switch. It suits the Switch perfectly. Oh, here we go. Oh, God. I did it. Anyone know where this is? Over there and there. Try and open that door. It's time to mash them with potatoes. I'm getting some perfects. Are oh, your little muscles tired? Sign says there's a machine room. I don't know. It, it says on there that some of the parodies are quite obscure, meaning probably just what the geezer that um, developed it played. But yeah, this game looks awesome. I've gone full circle. Sam, you'll love it. Yeah, it's it's good. I wish they had Jeff Set Willy in it, that's the only one I wanted there. And if you like this sort of music, well, you're, you're done for. I like the way it's all going on in the background, but you're controlling the action via the rhythm game in the middle of the screen. People are coming in thinking, oh, how the mighty have fallen, eh? Oh 
god, it's a lot harder than it looks, honestly, it really is. It's a challenge, that's for sure. He was watching the background, yeah. <laughs> Thinking this shit in front was distracting. When you play it, it's the other way around. I know, what is he up to? I know. I am hitting them in time. Yes, I am. The electricity has come back on. We should go up and see if the elevator is working. Yeah, I don't know this game. Does anyone know uh, where this, this particular level is taking its inspiration? That's Windows 95, look. Oh my god, look. Yo, this is, this is so cool. I think I'm the only one that thinks it's really cool. Communication with the space station re-established. System status malfunctioning. Space station entering. Defense mode. I think we're in the same world as our space station. Destiny. Oh god, no it's not, is it? <laughs> so the communication tower has been just under our noses since the beginning. That's the tower at the beginning, isn't it? Can't believe it. Rescue built 256 registered survivors. Uh, Arcan Arcanians did not survive the Exodus. The Exodus, billions dead. This world met an unfortunate end. Say, so, Tib, don't you think it's a bit odd that we're able to read what's written there? True, I've never seen these characters before. I wonder what this could mean. A world devastated, an unknown language that we somehow understand naturally, and a space station just above our heads. Perhaps Mother will have the answers. They keep on about Mother, don't they? Yes, she must be waiting for us at the top of the tower. Let's go, Rob. Let's go, champ. It's not possible. The elevator is broken. Can't repair it, but you'll have to cover me again. No problem, big brother. Oh, God, we're going to do it again. Mother is a reference to Alien. Oh, okay, Park. All right, yeah. Yeah, yeah, cool. <laughs> Come to Mama, Jason. Good boy. Sam, you're freaking me out now. He did it. Let's not dawdle. This doesn't look good. That's Friday the 13th. Oh, okay. Potatoes over here. You have to love this music though, you have to, it's awesome. I think the execution of the idea of what he's trying to do incorporate uh, the sort of coolness of the retro game in itself being played out in the background. Mix that with the actual game sound, you know, the music. I think it's done really well. I really do. <laughs> oh god, we've gone down to 17. I don't care. I'm, I'm having fun. I really need to stop using irony around here. Shoulder buttons.
takes a lot of your concentration. <laughs> It would be Puck, yeah. Which you wouldn't want to watch, would you? Would you? Oh god, I'm get not getting these. My hand is actually aching. That's a sign of a good session. Oh god, it's getting really hard now. Don't care. That is it, everyone. Thank you for watching. Hopefully, you've enjoyed this little indie title. Check it out in Steam. It's on Switch as well. Um, I will see you tonight for some, some scum. See you later.